Morning. Here's a little update on the roof framing. We've got the beam fully installed now. It's connected at both ends, sitting on top of a post and connected with a heavy duty bracket. And the two plies of the ridge beam are have been connected together. So we've got three of these <clears throat> connection screws um, every 24 inches. These are designed for uh, engineered lumber and the thread pattern and the length is specifically designed to pull those two plies tightly together. So effectively that's uh, one solid beam now with those screws in place. <clears throat> and we've got most of the roof rafters hung. We're hanging those using these rafter hangers, which are connected with these number 10 connection screws that are specifically for connecting these uh, <clears throat> metal connectors to dimensional lumber. And the way we're setting the rafters is we've got a little bit of an overhang at the top. So the rafter is actually sticking up one inch above the beam and that's so that we can have a ridge vent and a ventilation channel between the rafters. So we made this little jig. This, um, we're getting a lot of rain so we've been tarped up for a couple weeks now. This holds the tarp up off the beam and it also gives us that one inch space that we need for the ventilation. So that makes it pretty easy to set the rafters. So we've got them mostly set just um, Two more to go and then we'll finish up the gable ends, set the ridge beam in the laundry room and frame the roof in the laundry room. So that's next. See you then.